Welcome back to the Chocolate City Sports Break. I'm your host, Sonny C. Uh, putting a bow on yesterday's debacle. What we saw as far as offensive line play regarding the Washington football team yesterday was basically absolutely, it, it was trash. It was, it was trash all the way around. Um, you know, if you're gonna, I'm gonna stick to the plan. I'm gonna stick to the plan. Uh, these are some some of the frustrations that you have to deal with when you're a fan. So therefore, I'm gonna stick to the plan. But uh, what I saw those five offensive linemen uh, do yesterday on that football field was uh, a borderline unprofessional. You cannot get pushed off the ball ten yards back in the backfield on multiple occasions and multiple players. I know the Rams have an all-time player on their defensive line in Aaron Donald, uh, but you know what happened to game planning around a dude? Uh, but you know, you can't expect the quarterback to have much success when your offensive line is trash. I mean, I'm, I have to call it what it is, and I hate to use that terminology. But it's trash, man. Come on. Um, we got to get better. We got to get better. I thought our defensive line got pushed around, too. I thought the Rams were more physical than us. And uh, I thought we were, we got, we got handled a little bit in the first half. I thought we got pushed around. The second half, we, uh, we uh, showed some spine <laughs> a little bit. I thought Landon Collins, outside of that mishap uh, between him and Fuller, I thought he had a great game. I thought he played well. Um, the Shazer Edwards, um, we, we can't run through a receiver on third down uh, and, and let the Rams off the hook. Uh, Got to have a little bit more field awareness than that. But, uh, you know, it, it's sad, man, because, you know, we're, we're, not, we're, not, we're not a good football team. I mean, I'm looking at the stats. We're only averaging 181.6 passing per game. That's 30th in the NFL. Uh, rushing, 81.4 yards a game. That's 31st in the NFL. Points is 17.8 a game. That's 30th in the NFL. Points against. We're averaging 28.4 points against. <laughs> and, you know, that's the 11th in the NFL. <laughs> I mean, come on. We can't win like that, man. This is borderline unprofessional football. Um, but, you know, it's the Washington football team. What, what do we expect? Uh, those glory years, they're gone. They, they're, they're gone. Um, they've been long gone. So... You know, Ron Rivera, he's flip-flopped on a lot of topics this week. Uh, the honeymoon is definitely over, folks, uh, from the tenor of the, the media and especially the local media. Uh, they, they, you know, they're, they're, they're frustrated or they're, they're just a lot of questions. Uh, Dwayne Haskins, uh, you know, what he was... Um, he was out for a tummy cake or something. I've never, you know, I've never, I don't think I've ever, you know, seen that situation before where a player is, obviously he's a third string quarterback at this point, uh, deactivated for the game and he's sick. He called out sick. I mean, I, I, I don't know what's going on. I, I'm, I'm not even going to speculate. Uh, I, I did. I did read that he had unfollowed a lot of the players, a lot of his teammates. Unfollowed a lot of uh, the Washington football team. You know, this is rumors. I don't know. I can't confirm. I'm not on social media like that. But uh, if if that's the case, then you know he's just. This is the worst thing he could do, as far as trying to get uh, a, a foothold back to the starting position. Uh, but you know, he's a young player. He got a lot of growing to do. He won't be the first. He won't be the last uh, to handle a situation um, immaturely. Uh, you expect that for from uh, 21, 22, 23 year olds. 
but uh, he 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 needs a lot of growing. He needs to, to grow up, and you know he he has his family, and I'm sure they're involved in in his decision making somewhat. And but uh, someone needs to uh, get in his ear and say, "Look, man, come on, man. You 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 need to uh, you need to be a good soldier here. Uh, it's the optics are very bad. Yesterday's optics of him not being at the game was uh, is bad. It's bad for Tommy Gate." But, uh, you know, <laughs> it is amazing. It is amazing. But that's, that's the Washington franchise at this moment. Uh, drama. We always have drama. Drama is always lurking in uh, Ashburn. But uh, the Rams are a good football team, folks. Uh, I don't think, the, you know, we're the, the giant... <laughs> Looking forward to this week's game against the Giants. Um, you know, the Giants are playing pretty well. Uh, I knew they were they're trash, but they're playing pretty well. The last couple of weeks, they've been playing pretty good. Um, so, we go up there, and um, we got to get a win, man. We got to get a win. Uh, Dallas escaped with a victory over the Giants yesterday. Daniel Jones to me still is trash. I, I don't care what anybody say. I don't see. I don't see anything. I don't see an upside. To me, he's just a backup quarterback. I think he's. I, I think he's terrible. He's terrible. Um, but you know, we'll see. We'll see what the uh, long game is. But um, yesterday, man, I, I, I want to apologize for all the, to all the fans <laughs> who had the. Endure that game yesterday because it was garbage. What did we get? A total of 108 yards all game? 111 yards, something like that, all game? 111 yards? Maryland could have came down here and played us, and they haven't played a game all year and could have got 111 yards or more. Come on. Let's. Come on, Coach Ron, man. I, I, you know, I know you're going through it, bro. I, 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 you know, at this point, maybe I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I hate to be this way. I'm, I'm just, I'm tired of losing, man. I'm, I am really tired of the losing. But it's growing pains. I'm gonna hang in there. We have to hang in there with them. But uh, I have a lot of questions, and uh, hopefully they'll get answered. This week in New York, uh, we go up there and we play a, a, a good game uh, regarding a beatable opponent, hopefully. So, uh, man, terrible, terrible loss yesterday. But life goes on. Thanks for watching.